I'm walking some new ground. I uh, don't know if there's anything out here at all. can really hear the bees. They're all over this ironwood. This blooming ironwood. See them flying around? Springtime in the desert. Ironwood blossoms are underrated. I wonder if there's any petroglyphs in those black rocks. I've spent a lot of time in this area. You see those cliffs in the distance, those darkish cliffs. Uh, they're along an ancient river and there's a lot of petroglyphs for, I don't know, 20 miles or more. But the section I'm in is disconnected and uh, I'm not aware of any of them over here. I'm not seeing any petroglyphs. This one's a little bit healthier. Look at the blossoms. These uh, ironwood trees that are blooming right now, I guess I could mention that they're Noteworthy for having a uh, having a very dense wood, uh, specific gravity greater than one, so that uh, ironwood sinks if you put it in a bath or a swimming pool. Not like most woods. And a bird sitting there. Like a little graffiti on that rock. Some initials. We're heading for those hills. Nice rock for petroglyph, but no petroglyph. There's a hawk up there that does not approve of my presence. It's a distinctive sound. Be a little trail here. No petroglyphs. That's sort of a pretty one. And the bees like it. I'm up to look at this rock, but uh, don't see any writing on it. Well, that black rock up there is a possibility. Well, I'm three hours in, and I haven't seen any petroglyphs yet.
Well, I stopped at another little hill. See if I can find something. one over here that's certainly not a fake. Thanks very much, Link, for your desecration. See, the petroglyphs, petroglyphs look more authentic in the circle to me. Huh. Well, it's vandalism, but it's 100 years old. All those purpley tops are uh, ironwood in bloom. Heck, I found hardly anything today. That happens. 